Hi, how you guys doing? Uh, my name is Anthony and um, better known around here by most people as Brandy's husband. But uh, I just want to talk to you guys about missions and uh, how amazing they are. Um, I've been to Fiji and the Philippines through the church here and it's, it's just a blast. Um, I was asked by Randy, hey, you want to go to Fiji years ago? And I said, sure. And I thought, that'd be great. There's resorts and food and luau's, and I didn't know what it was, surfing, and which we got to surf a little bit. But uh, you get there, and it's, it's, it's a mission. You get to a small village, and you, you're put in a home with a host family, and you see that not everybody in Fiji lives like the TV commercials. Uh, they're not out drinking Fiji water on the beach, you know, having uh, foot massages, and it's, uh, it's rough, it's, uh, it's impoverished, and uh, some of the kids, uh, I called Brandy and uh, the first day and said, you know, I'm mortified, the kids are walking around in the jungle with no shoes on. So you see a different, you're, you're thrown into a different life, and it's a, it's a different point of view, and it challenges you as a Christian because you see um, you're in there, you're in the host house and you're down and dirty in the trenches and it's just a great experience and I'm still friends with everybody from the first one uh, in Fiji and also Philippines. I got to go there last year um, under who we called uh, the captain, Brandy, and she runs a tight ship so if you get that opportunity I definitely uh, suggest it. Um, that was beautiful too, the people, you get to go to the village, you get to go down to the barangay and uh, minister to the people and we went house to house praying for people. Uh, got the opportunity to go into the government ran hospital and pray for the newborns and um, Alma and Pamela actually suited up in the hazmat suits and they went into the uh, quarantine zone and prayed for the people in quarantine. Uh, the nurses all lined up. They could not believe that these Americans would come into the Philippines into this really dingy hospital with uh, you could see rats running around and stuff down on the lower levels and go into the basically the hazmat area and pray for people. They were just amazed. For me, it you come back and you're just different. You feel like you have more of a purpose because you go through your daily mumbo jumbo and you go to work, you go home, you pay your bills and everything just kind of goes along. But you go there and it puts you in perspective of what life is really about. You go there as this American wanting to change things and help them, but they're actually helping you. So I urge you guys to somehow go. Um, it's just an, an amazing, amazing experience. Um, from A to Z, and you will definitely be changed. You, you will, it, will, it will change your life, it will change your heart, and it's just completely worth it. Completely, completely worth it. I will definitely go again, and I hope to see one of you guys there with me.